question says let us see one more question this question says the parabola of a quadratic y squared to fx is shown below so we have uh, various information about this uh, parabolic graph the x intercepts are x is equals to 2 and x is equals to 6 so this is the x intercept and this is also your x intercept the y intercept is 12 so this is the y intercept the curve passes through the point a 7 comma 5 so this curve passes through point a and this is the point 7 comma 5 now the question is find the value of f of a so see nothing uh, uh, for this f of a there is no expression for f and we have to find the value for f of a as well as the value of f of 1 so you may uh, uh, pause this video here and try to solve this question yourself after your trying you can uh, play this video and see the solution okay so let us see the solution so right now how we can solve this first of all see we have the roots or the x intercepts of this quadratic equation or uh, function y is equals to fx so we can find the axis of symmetry axis of symmetry and you know how we can find the axis of symmetry axis of symmetry will be in between the roots or the x intercept so you will have x is equal to x6 of symmetry will be x plus 2 2 plus 6 by 2 see this is the x intercept 2 and 6 so in between them mid midpoint of them so 8 divided by 2 so x is equal to 4 it means x plus 2 4 is my axis of symmetry let us draw it so we may have this as we draw it again so this is the axis of symmetry okay one more thing we have to discuss here that what is the property of axis of symmetry why this is called as axis of symmetry you have to think over this also so the axis of symmetry has a very uh, important property that each and every point of this curve will have an image with respect to this line or we can say the graph is symmetrical with respect to this axis you know each and every point of this curve will have an image or we can say the reflection with respect to this axis suppose this is a mirror this axis of symmetry is your mirror so if there is a point uh, b here i don't know the coordinate so there will be image of this point b with respect to this axis of symmetry and that will lie on this curve as well so we can say this is the b dash or we can say the distance between this point and this line that is the axis of symmetry will be equals to distance between axis of symmetry and its another uh, corresponding image part this is the property okay let us see we have to find the f of 8 where is the f of 8 see this is the x8 this is your x plus 2 8 so we have to find f of 8 means we have to find the value of function for x is equals to 8 so we need information regarding this where it will you know what will be the y value here now how we can just see with a uh, you know rough sketching it seems to it should be 12 but we have to tell the precise answer so can you find the distance between the axis of symmetry line and this x equals to 8? See, this is the equation x equals to 4. Axis of symmetry has equation x equals to 4. And the point of consideration is x equals to 8. So, how much distance between x equals to 4 and x equals to 8? It's the 4 distance, 4 unit. So, what we can say, 4 unit in another side. If we go 4 unit in the left hand side, what we will get? From x equals to 4, 4 unit left. So, we will get x equals to 0. So, we will check. Does we know, do, uh, does we have the value of a uh, function at x equals to 0? So yes, you can see this is the y-intercept, which is the value at x plus to zero. So it means at x plus to eight, you will also get the same value that is the twelve. So it confirms our answer. I hope you have understood this uh, explanation. Let us see how we will find the value of f of one. Okay, the same concept applies here. Please see where is your n uh, f is equal f one, where is equal to x plus to one. So this will be a point x plus to one. Roughly, we can assume that this is the point x plus to one. Now, how much distance from axis of symmetry to this x plus to 1? So, x plus to 4 to x plus to 1, you will have the 3 unit. So, what we can check, does we have the value corresponding to 3 units, you know, right hand side from the axis of symmetry. So, when we will shift 3 units from axis of symmetry, we will get x plus to 7. We will get x plus to 7 here. So, please check, does we have the value corresponding to x plus to 7? Yes, see, this is a point 7, 5, which is passing through this, uh, the curve will pass through this point. So, it means, f of 7 is equals to 5 and we know that the f of 1 will be also equals to f of 7 and its answer should be 5 so its answer should be 5 so i hope you have understood a very important property of this quadratic function as well as axis of symmetry you may have a questions uh, question uh, based on this concept so please uh, keep in your mind thank you thanks for watching